What's up guys? So I've gotten a lot of requests to show you guys the tools that I use. Um, this is what you're going to need for basic window tinting. Everybody should have this if you're wanting to learn how to tint or if you're going to do a tint job. I would suggest getting these tools. This is my favorite handle, the Fusion 5. And then you want to get the blue maxes that are angled like this one is. All the other ones I don't like. These are the best ones to use. These purple tri-edge cards are the best cards I've ever used. You'll want to get this chiseler for uh, hiding debris. You'll see me use this one on almost every single video. This is the Conqueror and the best card for getting out corners uh, because it does have this squeegee on, this, on the whole edge of it. This is my best card that I use, or sorry, not card, but squeegee that I use for cleaning all my windows before tint. I would not suggest anybody using a flat, regular hard card for shrinking bad back windows. Get a card. I believe these are mainly used for, um, what is it called? Uh, I don't even know what I was going to say. But, find one of these that has the cowhide on it and you'll not go wrong. I've not creased one back window since using this card. You'll want a few of these um, blade holders. I found these at Lowe's. This is the best squeegee to use for quarter windows, small windows. I've had this thing for like three years and it still works just like it was brand new. Light gaps. You will run into light gaps. You will go to any Hobby Lobby store. You should be able to find these film OPEC pens. Black. They hide tint uh, gaps and they have been a lifesaver. And then I also have a bigger one. This card is really good. You can find this on 44 Tools. It actually has a little squeegee on the side here for getting in quarter, or not, sorry, not quarter, for getting in um, between the frame and the tint. This side swiper for back windows is amazing because it's so thin that you get behind brake lights. Same with the Bigfoot. This thing is amazing for getting in behind brake lights or in the sides of back windows towards the bottom. And then of course you have your bulldozer. You have to have this if you're going to use or if you're going to do back windows. This one's really good too for back windows um, for getting out any residual uh, water that's in your film. And of course a pick tool. You always need a pick tool. Pry tools also for door panels. So yeah. That's about it. If you guys have any questions, please let me know. If you want to know where to get any of these tools, I get most of mine from 44 Tools um, or Amazon. So yeah, have a great day.